Hello everyone, this is Christopher Carrington with GMUstudent.com and today we are going to learn a very cool effect. We're going to embed a Google Map into our web page by using Dreamweaver. This is a really cool effect because people will be able to see the Google Map, they can click it to get directions, it's fully interactive and it requires no coding whatsoever. So if you're interested, follow along with me and I'll show you exactly how to do it. So first things first, open up Dreamweaver. Let's create a new HTML. Let's go to design view. I'm in designer view and I'm in design view. So let's file, save as, and let's just call it Google underscore map. So now we're done with Dreamweaver. Let's go to, uh, let's open up a browser and go to google.com. I'm already here. So you want to go to your maps and you want to type in the exact address of where you want that user to see when they look at your Google map. So I'm just going to type in Times Square. So after you have the map fully loaded, you're going to see a printer icon, you're going to see a mail icon, and then you're going to see a little link icon. Click that link and go to Customize and Preview Embedded Map. So give this a second to load, and this is where you are going to tweak your little map and make it exactly how you want to see it. So you can click and drag this around and see how it says directions, search nearby, more. If you don't want that, click the X. If you do want it, click the A, and then it comes right back. You can also tweak the size of the map. You can make it medium, large, small, or you can tweak it by customizing the sizes by putting in your own sizes. And you can also move this around. You can maybe zoom out, zoom in, all this kind of stuff. So once you have it exactly the way that you want, you will copy this embedding code. This code immediately changes any time you move this around, so you don't have to worry about it. This is exactly how it's going to look in your web page. So copy all this by hitting Command or Control A, then right click and click Copy. Now we are completely done with the Google Map. So let's go back into Dreamweaver, and you do not paste that code that we just copied in Design View, you paste it in Code View. So now you want to find exactly where you want to paste that Google Map. I'm just gonna paste it within my body tags. So I'm gonna click Enter, and I'm gonna hit Command and Control V. And then refresh it, and we are completely done. Let's go back to Design View, and this is our Google Map. So if we preview this in a browser, save all your changes, and you are going to see the fully interactive map that we made in Google Maps. So your users will be able to move this around, they can click get directions, they can search nearby, everything that they need to do to find your business and it required no coding whatsoever. So this has been Christopher Carrington with GMUstudent.com and thank you for watching this tutorial.